outrages in both Europe and the Middle East, Donald Trump is encouraging Russia to attack our NATO allies. Dare, uh, during a campaign speech in South Carolina on Saturday, Trump recounted a conversation he allegedly had with a fellow world leader while he was president. Uh, by the way, by the way, it's one. It was one of those crazy. And someone stood up and said, "Sir, sir," yeah. and he said they were from a big country. Sir, sir, if they don't pay, if we don't pay, what will you do, sir? Yeah. Nobody's saying that. Anyhow. Like, what a jackass. How stupid would you have to be in that audience to go, oh, wow, didn't he really say that? Yeah. That's okay. amazing. I can't believe a big country president would say that. Anyhow. This but it was a stu it's just stupid. Like, he's he is now so desperate to support Vladimir Putin and undercut America's allies in Europe, he's making up a sir story. Mm -hmm. it's, it's not even It's not even a... It's not even a good lie for Donald Trump. Like, this is, you can tell he's losing it. Like, he's losing his touch. This is when Elvis couldn't even get, when he's so fat, he couldn't even get the scarf from around his neck to throw to the audience. He just kind of sat there and looked down and sang. Remember, look, you know, remember Heilman, when they had to hold the microphone? Yeah. For, for fat Elvis, when he was playing piano? 100%, yeah. Because he lost yes. all his moves. This is Donald Trump. It's, it's a story that a third grader would go, why is he lying to me? And you know the people in the audience, they can't be that dumb. To say, oh, uh, so by a big, big country person said, sir, what if we don't? Like, th this guy, this guy will do anything to justify defending and supporting Vladimir Putin and getting us all ready for, this is the dangerous part, when he's president again, he's getting us ready for him to be an autocrat, sure. a dictator, and a guy who's going to tell Vladimir Putin... Play sweep, it. Sweep in. Play oh, it before you want, we you want to play it? Because I thought my yeah. imitation sounded, I thought it sounded yeah. just, why would you want to play the tape? I like Joe's imitation it. better. Now, why would we play the sound? Just yeah. stick with Joe's. It's the best. Go, version. baby. Let's, play it. Let's do this. One of the presidents of a big country stood up and said, well, sir, uh, if we don't pay and we're attacked by Russia, will you protect us? I said, you didn't pay? You're delinquent? He said, yes, let's say that happened. No, I would not protect you. In fact, I would encourage them to do whatever the hell they want. You got to pay. You got to pay your bills. Again. It's like his, you're fired. Again, well, it's just stupid because it, it's a lie. Nobody said that. What president? What, what president? Did President Merkel say that? <laughs> Donald? Did <laughs> President Theresa May say that? Did President Macron say, Who said that? I mean, John Heilman, I'm serious. It's Had, so stupid. And the level of stupidity, like, to actually believe that story and cheer for it, really, it, it makes my teeth hurt so mind-bogglingly bad. I mean, just to say the thing out loud, heads of state, even of, of, of not big countries, of small countries, heads of state don't refer to each other as, like, don't, <laughs> like, like the president's called him sir, as if, they're, as if he's like the White House usher, um, not the way they talk to each other. And I think, Joe, it's an interesting metric that you've introduced into our vocabulary. We should really think about this, because as we chart Trump's decline, some of the things we should be monitoring are the quality of the lies. As they become yes. more transparent and dumber, that's one sign of kind of terminal decline. Another is going to be when the nicknames start to go. You know, when he starts, uh, when he starts like coming up with very late, he starts referring to Joe Biden as, you know, uh, uh, Cheery Joe or I don't know. Some, he's going to have some bad set of nicknames. Like yeah. the nicknames are going to decline. That's another sign that you know that Trump has reached the final stages of, uh, of ineptitude and political. Uh, okay. Well, this is, Let's th bring there's in. just no doubt. This is Fat Elvis at the piano. This yeah, is, that's that's right. where we are right that's now. Right. Well, Next, next stop, like right in front office. of the televisions in uh, in Graceland, where he's shooting out the screens on the TVs, right with the. Shotgun. It'll happen. That's com yeah. that's coming. That's